At the Lafayette County Courthouse, as dozens came together to learn the faith of Brandon Beesfield following the 2019 murder of Ali Castiel. There's no excuse for my actions. I ask God for forgiveness. And I hope one day that you will find it in your heart to forgive me. An emotional Brandon Deesville appeared before a judge confessing to the murder of Ali Costiel while also expressing remorse. I want to apologize to the Costiel family for my actions. I am sincerely sorry for the pain I've caused by taking out of you. The DA's office revealed during the hearing that Costiel was likely pregnant by Deesville and he was against her having a baby. Upset by the situation, he got a gun allegedly killed her near the Sardis Lake in Mississippi in July 2019. It's extremely sad uh, that this has occurred. Our prayers and thoughts are with the Costal family and with the Thesville family. During the hearing, Thiesville was made aware of his rights and also listened to written statements prepared by Costal parents. These felt embarrassment or possible shame or guilt will never compare to our lives. I bet she got a smile on her face right up to the last minute. Ultimately, the judge accepted Thiesville guilty plea, and both the defense and prosecution walked away pleased with the outcome. We are saddened for the Costiel family, but uh, happy that we could get this matter resolved in a way that prevents them any further grief. We, on, on the other hand, are, are grateful that uh, we obtained this result. We think we uh, spared his life and uh, there are different types of victories in these situations. Thiesville faces life in prison and could be up for parole at the age of 65. Following today's hearing, he was booked into jail. Reporting here in Oxford, Jordan James, WREG News Channel 3.